welcome back to my channel. Um, I was thinking the other day about what kind of video I wanted to make and I was trying to think of what I wanted to do and what would be funny and what would be interesting and instead of any of that I decided to go through this old box of crap that I have that's just like a bunch of stuffed animals and big ties from high school um, and just see what is even in here because I don't even know there's like journals those might have to be a different video, but like, there's just a lot of stuff, so I figured I would reminisce for a little bit. Okay, so this giant tie is, um, I used to go to youth group every single week, and I was like really into it, and I went to church too, and blah, 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 and one week we did a, um, a scavenger hunt, I guess it was, it was more like a photo challenge, if anything, actually, and we had to go around and like take pictures of us as a group, like doing stuff, so like, drink from a milkshake with like one milkshake with many straws and like you had to take a picture of yourself doing it and this tie had to be in every single picture I don't know really why that was a thing Bon Echo Provincial Park that's from when we went camping we normally like for the past like all my life we go to Algonquin Park but we decided to go somewhere else I don't know why I think just to try something new it wasn't great like no offense if you like Bon Echo Park but like it just wasn't Algonquin it just wasn't as good <laughs> this Weird, weird glittery heart that's like crumpled up is from when I went to go see <laughs> New Kids on the Block and Backstreet Boys at the like ripe age of 17. Um, when even was this? It doesn't have a year in it. Um, and this was like something you were supposed to hold. It says, Hold up his heart during Don't Turn Out the Lights to show New Kids on the Block and Backstreet Boys how much we fans appreciate this tour. Masquerade Bear. 2012. <laughs> Crown. Happy New Year. Four years ago. A cup. Pittsburgh Penguins cup. That's from when I went to Pittsburgh. Saw Pittsburgh Penguins. Soccer medal. 1999. Ooh. More medals. We got Ontario Championship. Ontario Volleyball. I don't know why it says Ontario twice. This was uh, from high school. And then Feb Youth Splashdown 07 Runner Up for vo Volleyball. That was um, another thing I did with my youth group. Class of 2012. Wee. This is like a little... Hi, Bear. Do you want to see him? He makes sound, but I don't know if it'll work. Okay, I'm gonna get jumped on. I'm gonna get jumped on. Or he's just really excited. This is really long. Okay. <laughs> That's enough of that. Uh, this... I got in grade seven when we took a compare <laughs> when we took a class trip to the butterfly observatory and I bought this. It's like this really derpy like caterpillar thing a bear wants to just devour. Which I'm not gonna let him do. My retainer, do I wanna open this? It should be fine. I mean I'm not gonna smell it or anything. Ew. <laughs> Ew. Wonder what would happen if I tried to put this in my mouth. It'd probably like rip my face open. The toy tractor. This probably has some epic story that I can't remember. <laughs> this. Do I only have one of these? This is a like, okay. <laughs> this is like a sleeve that you put on your leg and it was part of a Sailor Moon costume I had when I was literally in kindergarten. Bear stop. When I was literally in kindergarten and so you'd wear like red shoes and then you'd pull this on so it looked like you were wearing her red boots. Apparently I saved one. Oh, I got my Sears trainer, trainee little tag from when I uh, went to um, take your kids to work day with my mom, grade nine. Here's a journal. There's gonna be a lot of journals in here. I'm not gonna read basically any of them. Okay, it's Thursday, September 2nd, 2010. Okay, so here, oh, I wonder if this, okay, so here we have my latest attempt at a journal. I'm gonna take it everywhere and keep it in my purse and hopefully I'll actually, what was I using a purse for in 2010? So right now I'm waiting for Sydney to come over. Welcome to my entire life as a high schooler. Here's another journal. This looks a lot older than the other one. And also, oh, this is Nancy Drew notes. Okay, so I don't know if you've ever heard of this before, but there's these video games called Nancy Drew and the something or other. It's basically just like um, point and click adventure games where you like have to try to solve a mystery. And they're so good. And these are like my, they're so good. These are like my notes that I kept to like solve the mysteries. Like sometimes you'd have to like, write down a pattern or like a code or like phone numbers that you have to call like this is a card 
Happy birthday. There's some sort of weird dinosaur thing saying apples. And then there's grapes and then there's a pyramid. I made this for you. I, I don't know who this is from. They did not find their beautiful artwork. <laughs> I, 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 I don't know. Service, sunrise service, resurrection Sunday. Oh, this is from uh, Easter service when I went to church. Now I'm a heathen, no worries. Oh, this is, <laughs> this is my list of teenage girl problems and like why it was so hard to be a girl. Um, there's 22 points and each of them have like 10 sub points. I'll probably have to read that at some point. Cause I remember these being like really good points. Like a lot of them applied to like just any teenagers, but a lot of them were like just strictly girl things. Like. Your period is literally number one. This adorable wallet. Um, this is my friend Sydney's, and she had it when we were in like probably grade five. And then, you know, to keep the, like the change that her mom would give her to like go to the movies. Um, and then we got to like grade seven. She was like, this is so childish. Like, I don't want this little puppy dog purse. And I was like, I want it. I love dogs. And so I took it and I just kind of kept it. Like, it was just one of those things that like bounced around in my possession for like however long. Oh, when Christmas comes to town. This is when I went to go see my friend McKenna in one of her Christmas pageants. Um, she, she did it every year. Um, I went to see it a couple times actually. It was really good. <laughs> this journal. This journal is from my missions trip to Nicaragua in grade 10, um, which was also the missions trip where me and Nick like met kind of or like got to know each other. Um, so yeah, this is basically like my... Uh, What's it called? Like daily devotions, I think they're called. Where you like write about the Bible every day or whatever. I don't know. I don't think I'll ever read this because it's like really weird. And then there's all my tickets, ticket stubs and weird notes from when I was there. So yeah, there's that. I filled in like 20 pages of this, but whatever. Oh, this is again from the New Kid on the Block slash Backstreet Boys. Cootie Catcher, classic. All right, let's see what this says. Um, green question mark? It's so faded. G R E E N. Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Three. One, two, three. Two. One, two. Uh, five. When you leave the house tomorrow, turn left first. <laughs> what kind of cryptic bullshit is that? Also, like, I do. When I turn, when I leave the, okay, that was weird. Nicole, calm down. Here is a bus ticket, or a train ticket, from when I had to go visit Nick all the time because we were in a long distance relationship. Polished rock bag. Oh, this is from um, when we went to the ROM, uh, me and my aunt, and we, there was like a little thing, and it was like a huge thing full of these polished rocks, and you could go, and there's this size bag, and there's a bigger one, and it was like, you could fill it with whatever, whatever kind or color or size you wanted, as long as it fit in this, it was like a certain price. Cool, <laughs> rocks, so cool. Um, okay, what is this big pile of stuff? I'm just gonna like go through this stuff really fast. Birthday card, friend Ryan. Beaver Pond Trail from Algonga Park. TTC Day Pass from when I went to Toronto apparently. Birthday card, birthday card, funeral notice. <laughs> I'm not gonna show that. Happy holidays from Jenna. More, oh, oh my god, this is the steps to um, the Hannah Montana, what is that freaking dance called? I can't remember call. I'll put it on the screen, but it's like, pop it, lock it, poke it, dot it, country, or it's like country, I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna embarrass myself with that. Oh my God, this picture is so nostalgic. There's this guy that lived by the park that had two dogs, one was named Princess, and the other one was this one, I don't remember the name of it. And like you can see there was a van that used to park next, that sounds really creepy. There was a van that used to park next to the park. Um, and it was a library van. And so you, like an actual like Sarnia library van, you can go in and like get books. And it was like the coolest thing ever. Happy B-Day! Oh. Happy birthday, Nicole. Hope you had an awesome birthday. Love, Brie McKenna and Tyson. I remember this because McKenna made me this beautiful card. Look at it. It's so nice. It's like she handmade it, hand cut out like all those happy B-Day things. And then she brought it to my birthday party and I was so happy. And then my friends, my other friends who didn't think to get me a present, didn't think to get me a card, were just like, pass me your card and I'll sign my name on it. Oh, this is a big plan me and my friends made to go to Wonderland. We are in grade nine, I think, and we had like written down like everyone in our graduating class of high school to go to this thing with us. We were like, we were going to rent a bus and we were going to like buy all these like fast passes or whatever they're even called. Like we had all the numbers written down to like call and like 
order these charter buses and then it just like didn't happen because obviously we were like 14 and no one like cared enough to actually like go through with it oh this is like oh my god this is a novel that me and sydney were gonna write we got these doodles the magical pizza bracket from hell and bracket 3d glasses because it was cool to steal them from the theater the thing that's confusing about this is is that some of it is from when I originally wrote it and then some of it I went back later like when I was mad at people and like wrote stuff like on top of it I was like hate you or whatever Charles St. Cloud mysterious memory chip Sydney and Nicole sweet 15 black tie and converse accepted this is like back in the day of like being seen place Nokia theater seems reasonable this is just notes like me and my friends would sit in a basement and write notes to each other like on a piece of paper and like people are so worried about us texting each other when we're sitting across the thing from each other when like that's not new apparently <laughs> tiny slip <laughs> the sun on your cheek the wind in your hair the speed beneath your feet summer in your lungs a sparkle in your eye a tear in your heart this was probably like my goals like i was so obsessed with having like a perfect like rom-com high school special summer where it's like beautiful and perfect and i like, fall in love my old glasses no. that's random no. how do you think Apparently bears being bad. All right, fearless summer. This was the summer that we were gonna say yes to everything and we were gonna be so cool and like crazy. This, oh, there's a, literally a freaking contract. I have to go through this later because there's like multiple sections. Boys, winky face, good times, pl slash plans, to-do lists, other, and trackers. One Direction ticket, you can on the block. My best friend and me. Me and Jenna filled this out, I think. My best friends call me Nikki. No, they don't. 3D Justin Bieber ticket. Rivers Trail. Random doodles. Uh, this is a little, like, pen knife from of my papa's. Godzilla. Final Wars. Is that even a thing? Okay. <laughs> my friend Chelsea's Subway K. Oh, this was a picture of me and my boyfriend, but I whited it. See, this is what I mean. Like, I made all these, like, cute things with my friends, and then I went back as a jaded, older teenager and, like, whited out my boyfriend's entire, ex-boyfriend's, entire body because I was rattled. Like, what a mature person. Baby scrapbook. Oh my god, this was... <sighs> this will have to go through another video, too. This is from in high school when I did parenting class, and we had to take one of those babies, like, those robotic babies home, and, like, take care of it. Like, there's me, out and about, with my doll. My black baby doll, apparently. Oh, this is my grade nine student card <sighs> okay so that's it <laughs> that was a lot of crap a lot of things i want to go through in more detail because they're silly journals and stuff but i don't know how this camera works and it keeps shutting off so i'm gonna go <laughs> thank you so much for watching uh consider giving this video a little like if you liked it and you want to and you're looking forward to all the crazy amount of videos i'm apparently planning um and give a little cheeky subscribe if you would like i mean i'm just saying <laughs> um and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Later days.